Hello everyone, welcome to Automate with UiPath. In this video, we are going to see how to install UiPath Studio and Community version. People who are just now starting with UiPath journey and don't know where to get it, this is how this is the video that you need to follow. Go ahead. Normally, every single one who does or who wants to install it does the same thing. First thing, go to Google and search for UiPath Community Install Edition Download. The problem that's happening here is UiPath is giving out its free licenses only. It's not giving out its community license. That's the major problem that you're going to see here. But if you want to really download for it, then the URL that you need to go for is cloud.uipath.com or you can just search for cloud. UiPath.com. So this is like an orchestrator where all the robots and everything all the uipath platform will be available for you and if you want to check let's go to cloud.uipath.com you will be asked to register you can click on continue with microsoft or you can register with your own account and you can just get started once you complete the sign up that's when you are going to get the community license okay now this is awesome we have our orchestrator ready and if you can see here download uipath studio this is what you require Hit on save. This is uh, this will take some around 800 MB. Okay. Remember you logged in with specific URL or specific email. Remember that email. So once this is done, click on community, open that particular license. Once the download is completed, click on the installation file and you will be able to see some pop-ups like this. What you need to do is you need to click on quick. This is for community users. Don't go for custom. That is for advanced enterprise users and click on accept install. So we are trying to accept and we are trying to install our studio within our machine. Let's just wait. So I'm going to skip for later part where you need to add licenses and all. Pause this video till you see the next screen. Okay, so if I want to continue, UiPath is asking me to close all my Edge browsers and if I want these extensions and all. So the best thing is to close the Edge browsers, but even if you don't close the Edge browsers, you can still continue without the extension. I can click on OK. Let me just click on close and then hit on OK. So follow the um, options that it is showing. So UiPath Studio is completed. Let's go to launch UiPath Studio. Okay, this is 2022.10.1 uh, version. So if even if you are going with a later version or latest version, so you will have the same features. So while installation in some position, if you are shown something like this, like Studio or Studio X, you need to select Studio because you are a developer. You are trying to be a developer, but if you are a business user, then go with Studio X. But everyone does Studio. Now, how to install the license go to this particular place and click on sign in so when you click on sign in it will ask you see i said you cloud.uipod.com url right click on sign in okay and it will ask you to log in remember the email id that we used to log into cloud.uipod.com the same email id will be fetched and it will ask you or it will log you in if you have any other questions and your studio is ready, your studio is ready to start working. If you want to add any kind of extensions and all that you can see in the tools panel in the UiPath extensions and all, you can get it over here. So if you want a robot to assist you in starting out your robot studio, click on quick tutorial in the help section and it will give you all the information of what the studio is and how this will be available so this is where you need to start your journey click on start and where you can start your process and all so go ahead and start your automation journey all the best